Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Plus Size in Canada. My name is Miranda and I'm about to take two boys shopping. You wanna come with us? <laughs> Does it sound inviting? <laughs> These guys are actually pretty fun to shop with. We're actually gonna go thrifting. Um, we're gonna look for some back to school clothes, but we also might hit up a couple other stores if we have the time. So come with us, let's have fun together. Hello. I got a joke. Why do you never see pigs hiding in trees? Why? Because they're good at it. <laughs> <laughs> I just spent <laughs> way too much money, but my boys are happy. I got some stuff for Winnie too. And now I'm gonna pop into the grocery store because I really don't wanna cook supper. It's about five o'clock and I'm sweating buckets. And the last thing I wanna do is go home and cook and clean and all that crap. So we're gonna do it a little easy tonight. I'm gonna buy something that's already cooked. See, always thinking you guys. Not to be punny, but these strawberries look very picked over. <laughs> Like father, like son. You have a good day? All right. Is that a good toy for Jassy? Yeah. Do you want a new toy? Oh my sakes. <laughs> a new toy. Yeah. Aww. It's Nala, Simba's girlfriend. Be gentle. Be gentle. Don't hurt her. It's a girl. Oh, very nice. It is 6.30. We all had dinner. I cleaned up. Dishes are done. And I'm prepping some fruit. And it is delicious. And I just posted a TikTok about haters. So I'm feeling pretty good right now. <laughs> Anyways, I'm having a little... R and DC TikTok. <laughs> TikTok, my little birdies over there. <laughs> so today was actually super fun shopping with the boys, and they had so much fun. And let me tell you, for the very first time, they shopped by themselves. Like normally, when we go into Frenchies, they do themselves anyways. Um, you know, I 
tell them which spots to look in and they go look. Sometimes they look really well, sometimes they don't, it doesn't matter. <laughs> um, but they did that at Frenchies. But then we went to Marshall's, they literally looked for everything by themselves. I was like, look for t-shirts, look for shorts, look for sweaters, look for pants, anything you're gonna need for school. And they did that all by themselves because while they were doing that, like they were just excited because they saw Champion, they saw all their brand names and they were like, give us the cart, mom. And I was like, okay, here you go. So mom went on a little walk, bought myself some panties. <laughs> not even kidding and I found a few things for Winnie but we're gonna go through her stuff tomorrow because mommy has a lot of stuff to do and I really want to enjoy um, going through everything with Winnie I think Jasper's girlfriend's outside hi. just a second oh hi he's here that's a dog <laughs> so the boys found a bunch of stuff for themselves they even thought to think of socks they thought to think of is that a real sentence they remembered to think of. Anyways, they thought of something that I never would have thought they would have thought of. Whoa. Um, that was a mouthful. That's what she said. Um, socks and underwear. They even thought to pick up those. So I was like, oh my goodness. Like, I actually, like, I was really rolling the dice. I probably should have went through the cart to see what they got. Um, but I didn't until we were putting it up on the um, cash register area. And, like... It was a little expensive, but I mean, it's back to school. Like it's, I know it's July. This is the first time that we've started back to school shopping like for realsies this early, but I feel really good about it because Marshall's was super stocked backpacks, man. They had backpacks on backpacks and it's nice to get that stuff out of the way earlier so you don't have to think about it and dread it. And I do dread back to school shopping, especially, really I only dread the time that it takes. So I feel like starting it early, it was just fun. It, it wasn't stressful at all. So um, I'm gonna get the boys to show us both <laughs> everything that they got. Um, and then I'll show you Winnie's stuff tomorrow because I wanna talk about um, some of the things that I got for her anyways, but that's for a different video on another day. So I'm gonna call one of the boys up, whichever one is ready to show me their stuff. They're very excited, so just a sec. Okay, while we were thrifting, of course I had to take like a spin just to look for myself. Um, and I found a new bathing suit, you guys. I wasn't sure, it is a little bit worn out. Like it's not, it actually looks like the person who was wearing it um, stretched it out just a wee bit but it looks so pretty on me, you guys. It's purple, like, and it's pretty, and it really is like the kind that I'm used to because this is the style I've been wearing for years because it's like the dress style. So you, like, you can cover all your giblets and everything safe. And um, <laughs> anyways, I'm really glad that I picked this up for myself. I was unexpected. It is a Jessica London, ooh la la, and it's a size 24, but like I said, like it is a little bit stretched. So of course I had my clothes on while I was trying it on. So I don't exactly know how supportive it will be because it does feel like, you know, a little worse for wear. Like you can kind of see, you see what I mean? But I was like, you know what, Miranda, this is like what, nine bucks? I can't even remember how much they charged me. No, it was less than that. Um, I can't, I don't know because I don't pay attention to the prices at Frenchies because I swear it depends on what cashier you get, what number they put in. Um, anyways, it's a thrift store. It is what it is. I only spent $50 for everything at the thrift store. So I think I did really good. We already gave Jasper his toy. And I will say, <laughs> I tried on a Carol Baskin shirt, you guys, the leopard print. It looks so good on so many people. And I really did like the leopard print shirt. If you missed that clip, you probably blinked and missed it. But <laughs> I, I liked it and I wanted to love it on me, but I just can't vibe with the leopard print. I just can't. I don't know what it is about it. I don't know if it's Carol Baskin herself, um, but <laughs> which is from Tiger King. If you, she's a real person, anyway, and she is hilarious. Um, and maybe kill her husband. We're not sure. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, um, I think I just am a really like colorful girl. Cooper is distracting me so bad right now. He's literally dancing the robot right behind the camera, and I'm trying to get my point across. And I think it's just the fact that it's like really like dark 
colors maybe. I'm into like bright and happiness and I don't know how I'm gonna do fall because all I wanna do is wear tie-dye. We might be doing tie-dye in the fall. I am excited to wear like plaid and stuff like that, but also like, I just really like colors and happiness. And anyways, leopard print is not for me. So I will save that for all of my friends who look damn awesome in leopard print because I just, I don't feel it. It's just not me. I'm a cancer, maybe that color isn't for cancers. Like I know some colors are like more for each like star sign or whatever. I really don't look into that too much. And I should read my Bible, but I, I don't. <laughs> no offense, Jesus, I still love you. I'm dyslexic, that book is really hard to read. <laughs> So Jasper um, just unstuffed Nala a little bit. He loves her very much. And like, people are like, why do you keep buying your dog stuffies if all he does is tear them apart? Because he loves to tear them apart. That is the fun for him. It really is. So why would I want to take that away from him? I wouldn't. I'm not going to buy $20 stuffed animals for him. That's why I buy them at Frenchie's because they're 75 cents each. So chew them apart, enjoy your life, it's okay, and I'll buy you more, 75 cents. Like, they're just literally waiting to be reused. Why did I buy this one? Because it says Reese's, that's why. And actually, also because if you've been like keeping up with the vlogs and watching all the thrifting hauls, then you may know that, I think it was the very last time I went thrifting, I found Timon, but I've been calling him Timon, just because it's funny, Timon! <laughs> <laughs> from, you know, the Lion King, Timon and Pumbaa. Anyways, he has taken such good care of Timon. I think he has one less arm now, but he's still like, he's still rocking with it. Like he really is. So I thought maybe a little tiny cute Reese's stuffy might last a little longer and it's okay. Like he can chew those up and he can rip them up and it doesn't, it really doesn't bother me. Like I clean up the stuffy fluff, floofs that are all over the floor. He's playing tug of war with Cooper right now. And we have tried the indestructible toys. They're not indestructible. Okay, like, <laughs> they're not, okay? Like, trust me, I've seen it in action. They're not indestructible at all. It doesn't even really take him any longer to rip those open. But again, he loves them. So I'm not gonna take away what he loves just because he rips them up like he's a dog. Like, live your life, animal, you know what I'm saying? Anyways, okay, I saw this, okay? So you knew I had to pick it up. Initially, I thought it was going to be for Jess, but listen, you hear that beanie butt? It's got one of those beanie butts. So what I am thinking is I'm going to wash it. I'm going to save it. And my nephew, Theo, is obsessed with SpongeBob, just like your girl. And we always talk SpongeBob whenever we're together. He says, oh my goodness, he made masks. He cut out um, faces and put them on tongue depressors. <laughs> His pair, actually, his dad probably does have tongue depressors because he's a dentist. My sister's an eye doctor, so I don't think she uses those in her <laughs> line of work. Anyways, but he taped them on that, and he like sent me a picture and asked like, what other animal or what other characters from SpongeBob could I do? Like he literally drew the characters, made masks out of them. He's obsessed, and it's he's five freaking years old. Like he's a freaking genius, and I love him so much. Okay, like yes, I'm biased, um, but if you knew him like I did, you'd love him too. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, so I'm just thinking like his birthday's coming up in November. SpongeBob is actually not that easy to find in store, especially as toys. They do have mugs and stuff like that because I know because I found them for myself, and other people have sent them to me, and I'm very very grateful, and I love them so much, and they're of course a part of my collection, but. The toys are a little bit harder to find. So what I'm thinking is I will just start accumulating SpongeBob toys to give to my nephew for his birthday. So like, I just envision this like big gift bag, like SpongeBob themed gift bag filled with SpongeBob toys. Is that not a good idea? Like, I love that idea. Anyways, okay, this is gonna take forever. So I gotta, Cooper's like, yeah, just a sec. <laughs> oh yeah, also, there's my receipt. I spent $53.99 found this friggin' mug. And I do, I thought about it, I looked at it and I'm like, is this 2015? It's like not super cute. And I set it back down and I was like, Miranda, it's a Disney mug for 75 cents. You whore, pick it up now. <laughs> so I did. And like, I don't think it's gonna go up like on the shelves cause the shelves are full. All three of them on each side, they're full. Um, but I was thinking like, I could bring this down to my room, put makeup brushes in it. Like I should just like use, what do you think Cooper? Use mugs as 
like things to put stuff in all over the house. Good idea? Sure. Good idea. That's, I, I'm thinking it's a good idea. If it's not, don't tell me. Tell, don't tell me it's a bad idea, just shh. <laughs> so first, he found one thing while thrifting. He tried it on, he knows it fits. And this might look familiar to you because um, we actually have the same shirt. I think it's in a large though, and this is in a small, a but what's player. the different? Right, a different player. This is Gordon Hayward. Gordon Hayward. <laughs> Does that mean anything to you? Doesn't mean anything to me. Does it mean something to you? All right, that's all that matters. These under armor socks because I'm out of socks and Jasper eats all of them. You are not out of socks. But Jasper eats all of them. Yes, Jasper does chew them. And you like these kind? Yeah. These, what does it say? UA, okay, Under Armour Golf Elevated. Actually, tell our friends the exciting news about Under Armour. They're making a store in Moncton. Yes, when we were at PetSmart on Friday, um, we looked across the parking lot and we saw an Under Armour store, like under construction. And we are very excited because we like Under Armour, especially Cooper likes Under Armour. So that is exciting news for us. Next. Wait. That's the front, there's pockets. Okay. He found some shorts. Shorts, Spalding, basketball shorts, amazing. What's that? Oh, only $14.99, Cooper, you bargain shopper. Beautiful. Okay, what's next? What's next? He's he's got no energy, guys. He's low energy. I want you up here where I am. Woo! <laughs> this is super nice. What did you get this in? A small or a medium? Ooh, a medium. Très bien. Champion. C'est toi. Yeah. <laughs> I wish you guys could have seen him dancing over there because now it's like the energy has come back down. But I want you back up to when you were doing this. You know what I'm saying? Like the robot, yeah? yeah? Ooh, I like this one too. This is nice. Oh, and this is in a small. Huh, but you tried them on. Yeah. And you like how they this both is fit. A big small. This is a big small. That's kind of funny, but also not like that. <laughs> cool. What else did you get? You got a couple more things? Ooh, I found these actually. I found two of these. And it's a, uh, tell them what it is. Knee brace for, for basketball. basketball. Cooper had a torn ACL because he cut his leg open. It was very, very gruesome and it was a horrible time. And now he's going to have a knee injury for the rest of his life, basically. And a big old gaping Grand Canyon hole in the side of his leg. Um, so he needs this. And well, actually he doesn't need this. But this was only, okay, it says $25, but that's not it. It was $14.99 because it was at Marshall's. And I'm pretty sure the one that we bought you at Walmart was $20. And, and that's it's, like it just not even a brand. Yeah, it's like... No name, knee brace. Just like knee brace, no brand, just knee brace. But yeah, yeah, this is even cheaper and it's Nike. So actually I got one for Skylar too. I don't actually know if Skylar needs one or not. Do you he think? Doesn't. I think he just likes looking like he needs one. And we're like, the, the way that it looks, he thinks Cooper looks super cool wearing his knee brace. So he cool wanted in one. General. Yes, you are. <laughs> da, 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 da. Don't even talk about it. Don't even, he just, he picked it out himself. All right, and the biggest, most awesomest thing that he found, bam! Hit him with the one tap, bam, bam! It got bubbles on the It's back. got bubbles. Hello? Isn't that cool, man? Like, it's really squishy. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> but isn't that nice? It was $39.99 and it's we- normally $110. Right, and we actually looked at these when we were at Sports Check at the end of school, and I'm pretty sure we saw almost the exact same book bag for $98. Yeah. And we were considering getting it then, but we were like, let's just hold off. We'll see if we can find one like it, and we did. Good shopping. Oh, I knew you were gonna do that. <laughs> okay, we got Skylar with us now. <laughs> he just hit the light fixture because he is that tall. Um, he found a little bit more. What are you doing? Come here. Come here. Come show our friends what you're chewing on now. Huh? A Gatorade bottle. Just. I wonder where he got that from, Sky. My room. On the ground. By my table. Every time. Every time. His room is a disaster. And actually, it's not that bad. My room was worse as a teenager, but we won't get into that. Um, he found a little bit more at the thrift store because he's basically a man. He actually wears the same size as Curtis or bigger than Curtis. 
and men tend to take care of their clothes better than kids do so he just has more options so go ahead sky take it away it's your haul okay <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I got three pairs of jeans. Mm-hmm. Here's just a bunch of denim. Denim, um, denim, denim. Uh, here is the shirt I got from Frenchies. I like this One shirt. Of them. I, got I feel like girls your age would wear this with like um, leggings, like shorts, legging shorts, like, this like type biker shirts. Yeah. Yeah. They yeah. totally would. Yeah. That's like a Gen Z kind of thing to wear. Uh, and this is the other shirt, just an athletic shirt. Athletic, Everlast. Not to be confused with Everlong. Okay, now from, uh, now from Marshalls. It was Marshalls, not Winners. Marshalls, yeah. Did I say Winners? I don't know. I don't remember. It's um, almost the same thing. I got a knee brace. Cool, cool, cool. Um, underwear. Volcom underwear. Didn't, didn't even know, know they were a thing. Yeah. Very cool. That's like Volcom's like a skateboarding company and Skyler's hardcore skateboarder I'm so, more of a biker yeah he got a new bike now he's more of a biker because he already bought a new skateboard but that's old now yeah. like not even a year old <laughs> uh i got some socks socks <laughs> i feel like it, it's like one of your rap songs that he listens to he listens to these rap songs and the guy would be like yeah i'm in the kitchen then someone in the background is like kitchen <laughs> it's adlibs that's no the problem. whole time eat <laughs> Uh, Urgh, all the time. I got a book bag. <laughs> Look at this backpack. Oh, I'm doing it again. Yeah. <laughs> Adidas. <laughs> um, I got this shirt. I love this brand. It's beachy. Show them the back. Show them the back. Maui. It reminds me of. And what can I say except you're welcome? Uh, I oh, I thought Cooper shorts. got those. That no, was you that got those. No, okay. No. These are nice. Yeah. Oh, I like the drawstring. It's cute. It's like a rope. Yeah, I only cool. got one pair of shorts. Well, you still have lots. Yeah. Um, oh, I love I got this, this. Too. It's a hoodie, but... Uh, it's like, it reminds me of color. what Rocky would wear. Yeah, Rocky would wear. Rocky Balboa, if you don't know. Now you know. Uh, oh, yeah, I forgot. Oh, yeah, you tried a shirt two. on and then you went back and got that one yeah. instead. Okay. They're on oh, their little shark on it. Cute. Oh, I like that. So it's a little bit different, but I love yeah. the colors that he chose. Fantastic. Very exciting. So we're off to a very good start for both boys. Mother trucker, dude. <laughs> that hurt like a bunch he got a stick. <laughs> okay, so for myself, I got some panties. I did. And I... Talked about them before, Airy underwear, I'm obsessed. I love them. Airy is American Eagle, but it's like the comfy version of American Eagle. Anyways, I went on the Airy website not that long ago. That thing is very confusing, okay? I think they, like, have you ever been overwhelmed by just having too many options? That's exactly what I feel like on the Airy website, which is kind of like, it's kind of disappointing because um, the Airy Wipes website actually goes up to a double XL and in store sometimes they don't have double XL. They only go up to an XL. At least the last time I shopped in store, that's what it was at my store. Maybe that's changed. I'm not hundred percent sure. Um, because I do feel like a mom in Airy because it's, it's very much, I'm sure moms shop there too. Um, but it's very much like a younger person's store and I'm 36. So, <laughs> But um, I found the exact underwear. They're just a different, like, a pattern. Um, the last time I bought them, like, I'm obsessed with them. Like, literally, it's starting to get ripped, the one pair that I have, because every time it is clean, I'm taking that first. Like, that is my, I, I wear it more than any other. And I, I change my underwear a lot because, do we need to say it? I pee my pants because I'm a woman and I had kids. Okay, so <laughs> I just... I like to be fresh and clean at all times. So um, I was very happy to find three more. These are not my favorite pattern, okay? Like I, I wouldn't be like, woo, give me the stripes all day long. No, like I'm just like, okay. I love these kind of underwear because before I didn't know. I didn't know. I think my body's changed. You know, I don't, we're just always changing. Um, but the panties that I used to like don't have a top. Like they're just like that silky, um, seamless, no panty line kind of panty. And to me now, those just roll right down. 
There's nothing holding them up. They're not staying up. I literally, literally, actually, I'm not even gonna finish that sentence. Never mind. I was gonna tell you about today's adventure in the underwear game, but we're just, we're not wearing any. Okay, I said it. <laughs> and they were upstairs in the laundry and I didn't want to have to come upstairs. The struggle, okay? Yes, I didn't need to say that. I know. I'm an oversharer. Welcome to my channel. Anyways, they when I wear the seamless ones, they literally will fall right down and I'll be walking around town with my underwear to here and my leggings hiked up and it is just not a good look, okay? So I got these ones, these ones, and these ones and they're $2.99 each, you guys. $2.99 each. That's amazing for a pair of panties, okay? I am obsessed. I love these. And I'm so glad that I found more. And then while I was in there, because these aren't really like, ooh, come get me, baby. You know what I'm saying? Like, they're not like sexy time. I was like, mm, let me see if I can find some sexy time. And then I did, okay? Just some little lace, okay? Some little, just a little cutie, okay? Moving on. Um, <laughs> and I think that's everything that I got, but I am gonna show Winnie um, what I got for her at the thrift store. I actually didn't get to look through the whole um, bin because I stepped away for a minute to talk to the boys. And then when I came back, um, there was just a lot of people around it. And I still, um, actually I had a quite rude comment today. Why are you still wearing that filthy diaper on your face? Um, don't you know, aren't you fully vaccinated? Um, why are you still wearing that? And it's like, um, okay, hi, I'm in New Brunswick. Okay, know where you, know your place, know where someone is or don't say anything. You know what I mean? Like, okay, we were in PEI on the weekend. They don't have mask mandates anymore. So we didn't wear a mask. Like we stayed socially distant. We didn't wear a mask. Um, I'm in New Brunswick now and there's still a mask mandate. So yes, I'm gonna be wearing that dirty, filthy diaper on my face, okay? We both know it's a mask, not a diaper, okay? Anyways, um, but yeah, um, I still wanna stay six feet apart because like I've always had issues with germs before. It was cool to have issues with germs. So, uh, you know, I'm ahead of the game and I will never want to stand close to someone I don't know because I don't know where they've been. I don't know who they've been coughing on. You know what I mean? Like. No, thank you. No bueno. Um, anyways, so I got three shirts. Um, I'm showing myself at the same time that I'm showing you because I kind of forget Air Jordan. Air Jordan. And this coincides with a lot of the stuff that I got Winnie for tomorrow's video. But we'll talk about that tomorrow. Anyways, Air Jordan. Exciting. Exciting. This, how could you not? How could I leave this there? It is a flippy freaking unicorn shirt. It's a little worn out, but it's, I think it's Justice, isn't it? Let me hold on, hold on. Yeah, it's Justice brand and it's so my daughter. So I had to grab that for her and then, <laughs> hey babe. Hey. And then look, Snow White, a Snow White shirt for Winnie. Isn't that cute? Hey, and I yes. got something for Curtis too at Marshall's, which I forgot about. Come in the camera, are you in the camera? Mm -hmm. I got you some new flip flops. Ooh. <laughs> and they're so really rapid. soft and squishy. Really soft and squishy. My other ones stink real bad. But I think it was the beach. I I think it's your feet. No, no, no. Because I smelled the entryway this morning and I was like, throw those babies out on the deck. They were already on the deck. Oh, that's because I threw them out on the deck. No, I threw them on the deck. Well, yes, they got did. back in and then Ooh, I put them back in. I don't know. They but do stink. It was, but I, th I think like it's a lost cause. They just need to be thrown out. Yeah. But well, we got, got you new ones. Them. That's awesome. And they're, they're squishy. It. This is our pump. What the frick? Oh, we got an issue with the trailer. Yeah, it's trailer freaking brand new. Died. Um, oh, I thought I was going to get stabbed or like zinged. Well, oh, by the way, I'm watching Iron Man 2 right now. I'm going through like the Marvel universe. And right now I'm in love with Tony Stark. And hey. I put only a little. And um, I didn't know like, why is he a superhero? He's got no muscles. And then he took a shirt off and I was like, oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> you have more work. muscles. I'll work on it. No, you have more muscles, then you're getting the lacy parade tonight. Okay. <laughs> now I got uh, video proof. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think? Isn't that amazing? And she dressed herself today, you guys. Don't you love the fashion happening? Love it. And look, the shirt over there is Air Jordan. It's a basketball shirt. Can you believe it? Yes. Next year. Uh-huh. This year. year. Mm-hmm. 
So fun. And look, can you tell which princess this is? Snow White. Snow White. Hi, babies. How could I not tell which princess this is? She's literally on it. Yeah, she's literally on it. <laughs> but, but she's kind of black. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, You're welcome. <laughs> All right, you guys, I'm going to end the video here for today because I still have a lot of work to do. And it's 7 11, 7 11 right now. So I love you guys. So crazy. I will see you tomorrow. Have a great day. Mwah. Bye. <laughs> Peace out. Oh, yeah.